Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to Let's Play Sly 2 Band of Thieves and let's continue with the game where we last left off. I should make my way over to the Contessa's house. Maybe I'll pick up a few leads on the location of Sly and Murray. And yes, now it's Bentley's turn to shine and be the hero and bust his friends out. I didn't hit. Okay, turn around. Exactly, I need. Oh. How do I get over there? They got freaking tanks. Oh. oh. 
that didn't go very well. well. At least I got the bottle. Man, how do I get it? Asleep. Before I place the bomb, it doesn't help if they are already asleep. Well, good to know. Get up there. Oh. Ah. Well, let's hide here for the time being. Contessa is out making her rounds. Wait a second. The feathers on my sleep darts vibrate near sounds. If I maintain my position on top of this parabolic dish, I should be able to hear that frequency at a distance. This is great. If I tag the Contessa with my darts, I'll be able to listen in on whatever she says. I might even learn where she's locked up Sly and Murray. Contessa with darts. The claw gang is falling apart. Spice shipments have all but stopped. Ah, I never would have joined if I'd known it would be this easy to disrupt the plan. 
At least the Cooper gang is under lock and key. Their lopsided morality flies in the face of man's inherent selfishness. Ah, well. They'll see it my way soon enough. I'm gonna try. No, it doesn't. I tried that once, but I just wanted to make sure. Those fools at Interpol. They keep sending me criminals and I keep making money. How come no one ever thought of this before? Hypnotize criminals and force them to reveal where they've hidden their fortune. I'm a genius. If only I had more spice to help me with the hypnosis. Gang. The fat one. What's his name? Murray. Yes, Murray. He'll be the first to break. I should spend a few sessions probing that feeble mind. I can only imagine the wealth that gang has accumulated over the years. That's like Cooper. Such a complex and rebellious mind. A month or two in the hole should break his spirit. Let him squat there week after week. He's seen that the guards along the wall all have motion detectors. There is no escape. Slowly, the reality of his captivity will set in. And I'll get to work on his mind. Inconceivable! She's no healthcare professional. Why, that's the most heinous crime I've ever heard of. Putting inmates into hypnosis so they'll tell her where they've stashed their loot. It dishonors both law enforcement and thieves at the same time. I should get to work and figure out a way to break Sly out of the hole. <laughs> if I can break Sly out quick quickly in this video that computer is part of a control system for the electromagnetic train by hacking all the terminals along the train tracks I should be able to reverse their polarity thereby turning the train into a giant projectile without question its impact on the prison walls should create a hole large enough for Sly to escape through Stick should control by cyber avatar. 
I'll have to hack through these barrier nodes. I should move the right analog stick in the direction I want to. By using both analog sticks at the same time, I'll be able to move and shoot in different directions. That's one down. The train should be picking up speed. I don't need to destroy all of those. Two down, four more to go. Sorry. That should speed up the train by at least fifty percent. Give me a checkpoint. Oh. oh, that was so lame. Ah, that was lame. Okay, let's. Oh, 
do tell where where those two turn oh, there's Okay, one more to go after this. this is the last terminal was this close next mission we'll go and save Sly but that'll be in the next video I think two missions is good enough for now I'm just gonna go and hide here so when we come back ladies and gentlemen let's go and save Sly and get the game back together but it'll be in the next video until then as always I'll see you when I see you later <laughs>